Hi, my name is Matt, and um, my family and I have been coming to True Grace for about three years. Um, it was right after the lockdowns finished, after COVID. That was kind of our, our reset, coming back to church. Um, we hadn't really had a lot of connections, um, a lot of friends at other churches that we had been to. Our typical Sunday church going routine would be, you know, we get up, we get ready, we go to church, um, and then we would um, not talk to anybody on the way out, and we would not make any connections, and we'd go home and have lunch and do it again next week. Fast forward to 2021, when the opportunity to help out with First Impressions team came up, I decided to serve in that way because I really wanted those connections. But there's a second reason too, and that's because uh, Pastor Dave asked me to. When a leader asks you to serve in some way, I think that they, are, they see something in you and they, they see a need over here and they're looking to have that need met. The way that I usually handle these things is I kind of start in my head, what are the reasons that I cannot or should not do this? And if the only reasons I can come up with are silly reasons, like um, I need 20 more minutes of sleep or I'm gonna miss Sunday night baseball, then should probably stick with the yes, right? And it's not about being a people pleaser or a yes man, but it is about like recognizing that there are a lot of active hands required to make this church. As a member of the First Impressions team, um, you just get to meet a lot of new folks and new opportunities come up. I had someone ask me to help um, teach a class. There was another time one Sunday morning when um, I was talking to a gentleman um, and he said, well, I'm the leader of a life group and I think you should come to my life group. And so I sort of did that process again, where I, I, I asked myself, why, why should I not do this? I couldn't come up with anything. So now I'm part of a life group. When you serve and you connect, you, you will find other opportunities to serve and connect that you didn't even know about. As a result of serving, I have had two of my kids now, they're volunteering in the church in some capacity. In 1 Peter 4, 11, um, if anyone serves, he should do it with the strength that God provides. For folks who are sort of on the fence about whether they should volunteer in church and step out into that role, God gives us the strength to do things that we don't think that we have the capacity to do. And I've seen that play out numerous times in my life, and he'll do it for anyone who's willing to step forward in service.